Okay, initially, Scott, you just get your chin up just a little so your spine angle is a little straighter, a little more vertical, and your hands will hang down in a nice natural position. And as we come back, you want that shoulder to go right underneath the chin, and then drive onto your front foot using that weight shift onto your front foot, a nice drive into the ball, and hold your finish for a nice impact. You just have to get the lower body, the hips and the knees rotating a little bit more. So that change of direction from the top of your swing back down into the ball, you're using your legs a little bit more and you're turning that, those hips on facing the target.